<sighs> come on, come on, come on. Last bit, last cream egg, but I'm actually gonna throw up. <laughs> Happy Easter. This is definitely one of my favorite days of the year. You can eat as much chocolate as you want and not be judged. So for that reason alone, I've decided to eat chocolate eggs for 24 hours. I'm gonna try and mix up some food ideas as I go along with it so it doesn't get too boring, but I'm really looking forward to this because I am a chocolate lover. For anyone who knows me, I've got such a sweet tooth. I don't think that words like sickly should even really exist because that just literally means that you've got the perfect dessert. And if you order a cheese board rather than a chocolate brownie, just, you can unsubscribe now, honestly, just feel free. So while I have probably one of the best days of my life, you get to enjoy watching me eat as much chocolate as I can. Starting with my breakfast, with two cream eggs with Easter eggs to dip in. I'm also gonna eat mini eggs out of an Easter egg bowl using chocolate milk. And to be honest with you, this is the only thing that's gonna give me any nutrition today. It says right here, it's got 17.1 grams of protein. So that's about the only good thing I'm gonna get in my body throughout this whole 24 hours. Time lapse of me eating in three, two, one. I'll be honest, the shape on its own is actually pretty dead. Like for a chocolate flavored drink, the, the chocolate taste is awful, but fat free, protein, low carbs, which is really gonna help when I'm being super healthy and eating things like this for the day. If you don't do this with your bowl of cereal either, I do think you're a little bit weird. Why would you wanna waste the milk, and especially when it's mixed with all that cereal goodness? Truth, is the egg runny enough? Perfect. So it's breakfast done. It was a lot of chocolate, so I can hold off for lunch now and not feel too deprived. I reckon that's over about a thousand calories, but I'll put a little thing here now saying exactly what the total was so far. Probably gonna look to go for a run or something like that. Try and burn off some calories today. All my snacks today will be chocolate eggs. My lunch will be chocolate eggs. And my dinner, I've got a little chocolate egg twist that I'm planning. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. A little snack on route. Some more mini eggs. Back from the run. Not really feeling that hungry, I can't lie, but lunch it is, a couple of eggs. I mean, I do love chocolate, but it is one of those with these sorts of videos where you do fancy something else, something a little bit savoury maybe. I had a little workout earlier as well of the calories that I'm actually going to consume today. It's actually a disgusting amount. I'm not going to give it away now, I will save it for later in the video for you to see as a total, but little subscriber plug here. If you're not subscribed to my channel so far, please consider doing so because this is gonna take me a whole lot of working out to try and burn these calories off after this. So I'd really appreciate it. I actually reckon I could do half an egg in pretty much one mouthful. Might be grim, but let's see. Do you know what? I'm gonna do that in two mouthfuls. Lunch finished. I reckon that was about a thousand calories maybe. So just a small lunch. I didn't really feel that hungry at the time, but it is weird how you get little sugar crashes. Just after eating, you feel really full of energy. Then all of a sudden you feel quite a big come down and you feel really tired as well. Like it's sort of filling a hole but it's definitely not satisfying enough. Like I've seen other bits of food being prepped around the house and I'm getting very jealous. I mean, it sounds like a great idea, nothing but chocolate for a whole day. You think, oh, what a dream. Very, very quickly you start to feel, even on your tongue, man, like it goes really weird. Like you've had too much sugar, too much chocolate. I'm super, super jealous because there is homemade Nando's going on tonight as well. Uh, so yeah, what a day to decide to do this on a day. <laughs> on a day where there's gonna be homemade Nando's in the house. So it's gonna smell amazing. And I'm gonna be sat there with my little dinner surprise. It's been a few hours since uh, lunch and 
I can't lie, I am starting to feel so hungry, but also kind of sick <laughs> because I'm just craving proper food now because my stomach literally feels empty. But then at the same time, uh, I feel kind of sick and weak. Like I've not really eaten very much today, but obviously I've eaten loads, but it's just not given my body the nutrition it needs. It's time to start cooking dinner. This is a unique recipe of mine. So I'm gonna show you the steps of how I'm making it because you know I'm a top chef. I said it'd be an interesting chocolate egg twist, so I've decided to go for my own little design of a homemade chocolate egg pizza. There's a good selection of chocolate, I don't think you'd deny it. Milky Way, Smarties, Terry's Chocolate Orange, then obviously the cream eggs on top. It's like the pepper army to the pizza. Yes, technically, obviously the base isn't chocolate, but you've got to allow me that. It's the tiniest bit. But I thought it'd be a little bit more interesting than me just eating another Easter egg. I don't think anyone else will be trying this combo either. I'm not too sure it's gonna work. because unless you have a stuffed crust on a pizza and you still eat it, you're a proper weirdo. Sorry, you heard it here first, but you are. I'm starting to hit a bit of a wall here um, and feeling quite sick. I mean, so far I've done four out of, well, four and a bit out of six slices. It's, uh, it's rich, it's... <laughs> so chocolatey the mix of all the chocolates the chocolate base which was basically a chocolate bar which i melted down oh, ah, this is getting hard i'm actually starting to feel sick at the start of the video i did say that sickly isn't a word um or not a word that i would use to describe food this is borderline this is borderline this is getting there this is a lot of sugar like i don't even want to know what my blood sugar level is after today probably got myself a one-way trip to type 2 diabetes after this because uh, i've literally had nothing but sugar as my main group main food group for today i'm basically buddy the elf certified you know you're getting full as well when you're having a stare off with you a bit of uh chocolate egg pizza see how this goes it's gonna go one way or another because i'm starting to feel really uh ill Ooh. I mean, apart from the crust, I've only got one slice left, which the way the topping on it is, probably four or five mouthfuls. I am so close to throwing up. I think I'm gonna struggle with those four or five mouthfuls. Oh, I don't want this to be a pancake video take two. I've eaten so much of this and I feel awful. I felt bad from the second slice. So if you are still this far in the video and you have not subscribed, I beg, please subscribe because this is grim. Last few bites and then I've earned myself a dessert. Last bit, last cream egg, but I'm actually gonna throw up. Mm. Mm. I'm sat here punishing myself over this pizza. You can hear it in the background, they're grilling halloumi for the Nando's that I was talking about. Why, it smells so good as well, the chicken with the seasoning. I actually need to go and lie down in a sec, so I think I'm gonna throw up. I will not let the demons of my past haunt me. The pancake video, get it out your head. 
I only did half of it, I flopped. This, this is dumb. This was difficult, I feel awful, but look, you can see, that is just crust. Yeah, that is just crust, and as I said, anyone who eats crust when it's not stuffed, you're a weirdo. This, oh my God, I'm so happy. I feel horrendous, I feel sick. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna stop this now. Um, I'm going to go and lie down, because I feel disgusting. I've definitely hit over 6,000 calories, but I'll put the total up here now. The fact that literally every single part of this food group was sugar, saturated fat, and fat, that makes me feel grim, but, but, Gym's open in a couple of weeks. I'm gonna start properly calorie counting, properly dieting. Summer's on its way. Um, happy Easter, everyone. I just learned something new about my GoPro. If I say stop and recording, it, it, it shut me off, so that's pretty cool. Three, two, one, stop recording. Stop recording. GoPro, stop recording. We got there in the end, third time lucky, but still a cool feature. Anyway, bye.